Hello everyone, welcome back to Art Labs. Today I'm gonna show you how to make this into this. Stay tuned. So yeah, hello. It's been a while since my last videos. How are you guys? I hope you're good. I'm winding up after the finals, like around probably two days ago, I submit my final projects to be judged if I'm eligible for the, the final thing in January so we're just waiting for the results right now finger crossed so yeah and then because I was so exhausted I spent like almost all day yesterday sleeping back and forth so I decided like I have to do some art for myself and then I think yeah I'm gonna do this so when I was scrolling down on Instagram, I found this photo of a girl wearing a kimono and then I, I think to myself that it looks good and then I think it's probably a good practice for me to do things. So at first I, I tried to capture the, the pose and then the, the anatomy of the, of the character of the girl but then after struggling for a while, I think I closed down the, the references because I don't want to be too focused on making like it looks like the photo so I, I closed down the reference and then I started to go doing my own things refining my own sketch and right now you can see I'm adding some blocking and then I add some shadows around the eyes around the, the under the brows and etc yeah so if you see my process here I'm doing the the grayscale first because it's easier to do the value first and then after that you can do the colors later. But yeah, it looks good. And then because I did this like in a wimp, so I don't really plan to do this. So because of that sometimes you can see me making some mistakes like I undo things a lot, like really, really a lot. Here I'm. I try to to render it, but I I don't I don't want to render it like too realistically. So I'm, I'm just adding some some definition on the face, like the cheeks, the nose, the area under the eyebrows, and then also the the necks. And then after that, I think I moved on. So yeah, right now it looks like I'm doing the shadows and then yeah another shadow to make another gradient to make it looks dimensional and then I did the colors right now I think some areas around the value is not really dark enough like the hair and then the the belt itself it's not dark enough also also the eyes I, I changed several things around when when I'm coloring here so as you can see, I'm, I'm going back and forth to the gray scales and then to the to the color itself. And then after this, um, I merge all the layers and then I, I, I go to color balance and and pick the, the best colors. And then at the, at this time, you can see I was trying to go to on the internet to look for some references to make some patterns. But as you can see, the internet is dead. So yeah, I improvised. <laughs> so at this at this point, after I add some some gold at the at kimono, I'm trying to, to to think about the best scene to represent the girl. So after some thinking, I feel like I want to do some kind of dramatic lighting. But after some attempts, as you can see here, like I keep undoing things, and then after some attempts, I think I found the solution by making hot spot like there are some trees around her so it's only several several lights that came through from the leaves and then oh yeah that, that, that looks that looks really good and it I try to find a, the right balance to it and then after this I try to make some trees and then yeah it failed I think several first attempts and then after several attempts I think I, I found the, the the better one so I used it 
And at this point, I think, okay, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna call this thing done. So I'm just gonna do some, some post, post production stuff, and then after that, bam, yeah, it's done. So yeah, here it is, the painting. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more. I think I might make another one, probably today or tomorrow. I don't know. I might make something for for Christmas. So yeah. See you later then. Goodbye.